happy vlogmas day 19. I think that's a rocking horse. Get your hands dirty. Feeling mud, leaves and trees helps connect us with nature. Eyelash curl ears. I remember I went through a phase of bothering to use them and I saw a tip. If you use a hairdryer and you heat the metal slightly, then when you curl them, you'll get a better curl. Good morning. I've just had the biggest sneezing fit, hence my super red nose. Look, I have no roots. Oh, I love this feeling. It's like I'm a natural blonde. But from wearing my scarf and coat and then sleeping on it, I have the biggest kink on the back of my hair, which is very annoying. <laughs> Last night I posted a picture on Instagram and dear God, it's my most liked photo. I woke up and it was on 8.5 and it's currently on 9.3 thousand likes. It's crazy, literally, this is the importance of hashtags. I went in my insight. 14,000 impressions came from home, so people scrolling on their home feed, and 218,000 impressions came from hashtags. That's crazy. 95% of people weren't following me. I gained 50 people. I'm almost at 1,000 saves. 156 people have like sent it in direct messages to their friends. Honestly, crazy. I've had it before when I posted, I don't know if you guys remember, I posted a picture of this side of the room and it was a horizontal photo and I posted it quite late and I was saying about, oh, I, I don't usually post this late. I'm breaking that rule. I'm breaking a rule of Instagram says don't post horizontal photos. And at the time, that was my like most liked photo. That one got... 4.3 thousand. I use hashtags, I basically use the same ones every time, but it's not always that it gets picked up, but when a hashtag goes crazy, you can see the importance. And if you hadn't have used it, I probably would have only got 1.4 thousand likes, which I say only, that's still really good. The fact that I think that will hit 10K. I text a call from Berries and Gray and was like, the photo of the chair I have from you guys, it's gonna hit 10K, I think. And she was just like, what the hell? Instagram is just, a game at the moment isn't it i've done some of my christmas wrapping so whenever i get boxes i keep them to reuse them for presents this is for nicole i'm seeing her on thursday this is for jenny i'm gonna post this out and this is for kylie i usually see her on boxing day so i can give it to her then i don't think i got round to showing you it all done but this is it all dry the varnish on it has a lovely sheen to it so yeah Pretty happy with that, how shiny it is. Today I'm doing a load of wrapping, so I'm sorting out all the presents that I need to send. The aim of sending it today, I have to show you this, this is very satisfying. I have a box to send one of my friend's presents and it literally fits perfectly. How satisfying is this? This box fits in there perfectly. Maybe not height-wise, but that's fine. I can just I can do that on it. Just taped up the boxes so now I can pop to the post office and send the presents. Before I pop out to the post office, I thought I would show you some of the things I've been sent recently. And I placed an order of ASOS, which I will be doing a little trial on with you guys later. And this arrived, I won't show you the item, but I ordered some stuff from Heather. So that has arrived. So we can parcel that up as a present. Other presents I've ordered from the Independence from the giveaway. So I have a wire sign for one of my friends and a load of baubles. Backstage are one of my favorite lash companies and they remembered what my favorite style was. The Chelsea ones are really, really natural. I just trimmed them down a little bit because I have little eyes. I've got some more of these and I didn't even know they did palettes. This is their Girls' Night Out palette. Look at those, a lovely mix of mattes and shimmers. Feeling incredibly spoiled. Look at this array of products. Thank you, Lorna. She said, happy vlog, Miss Leanne. Find enclosed a little package to help you through all of the filming and editing this month. A few products for the ultimate pamper and a few to help you sparkle and shine through the festive season and beyond. Thank you so much. I love being, I have quite a few of their products. I went to Ibiza with them last year. Mane and tail, I've not tried this. This is the hair straightener. Feeling like I need to use this. Volume and Bounce Hairspray by Charles Worthington. I love Kiko, I've already had a look at this lipstick. This is in a beautiful shade. Tan, La Roche-Posay, this is a gel cleanser. 
I love this brand. I visited them in Paris before. This is a beautiful cologne. Sanctuary Spa Liquid Gold Bath Elixir. Anything bath related, we much appreciate it. A SOS Party Kit face mask. The Beauty Blender Bounce Foundation. This is controversial, isn't it? Weren't they the ones that had the very limited color range? Oh, my favorite Evo. This is a water killer dry shampoo. Oh, this was hiding. This is a Shine Serum. I've not heard of this brand before, but I really appreciate this packaging. This brought such a smile to my face. That's so crazy. This is like an old picture of me and they had it turned into a card. So thank you very, very much, OGX. I have a me on a shampoo bottle. I have the conditioner and the hair oil. Not sure if I showed you guys this when I was in H&M yesterday, but this is the one thing I picked up. As if I went to H&M and I bought no clothes, but I left with this. Nuts. <laughs> Look at all of the unnecessary packaging. At least they have them without as well. Can we make a gingerbread house? No. I might take it to Nicole's. I'll do it a bit Nicole then. That is a big avocado, dear God. Is this tourism? Is that, oh. is that a type of avocado? I don't know, but can you cut through that one? <laughs> I think everyone's bought their potatoes for their roast dinners. There are hardly any here. I picked up some brie because I really enjoy the cheese that I had when I was in the coals. I still need the crackers and Paul put that in the trolley. That's four pounds worth of crackers. I can have a lot, you can have a lot. Maybe you can take some to the coals tomorrow. Okay. There's eight cracker variety. Who you knew you could have so many crackers? All of these things that have just accidentally fallen in the trolley. So today we're going to cook twiglets. And for this we're going to need vegetables, we're going to need meat, and we're going to need avocado. That's right, to do a twiglet. No, not really, we're going to do chilli con avocado. I'm going to add a bit of chilli powder, paprika, turmeric, good old cumin. I used to think you're crazy, but now I see your nuts. Oh, teamwork, eh? Teamwork makes the dream work. The salt in there? I thought this was my dish. Now I don't like my broccoli too hard, so I give it a little bit of water in here. Get it spicy. Giving it spicy? Yeah, I don't know what I meant. Can I have some of the spices in there now, please? Nope. Why? This is my dish, keep going. It's fine, I don't want to overcook the mints. Now you can. <laughs> Never really done instructions with this dish. You guys will be proud. Oh, I, just then. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I thought. Oh she looks like a sunflower. Two dollops of that. Now, how good does that look? I mean, I don't know if the camera's on that right now, but. Still close up. That looks pretty impressive. And there you go. Chili con avocado is served. I'm gonna do a berry try on. I have quite a few. And I will pour here to give me his opinion. How many types of berries are there? It's the colours. Who suggested that you should get one? Me. Yeah. I have black. Did you order all these colours because you don't know a colour? Because I don't know what ones will suit me, so I've got it's them It's a good thing that you can return these things on any sauce, isn't it? Exactly. I'm trying to go through the colours. Okay. okay. There's black, grey, mustard. I got two different camels because one was a bit cheaper, so they're all, I think they're all like £10 on ASOS, for ASOS brand, but this one was in the sale, £7.99, so I thought if I prefer it to this one, I can take a more expensive one back, so there's two camels. So how much are these each? I just said they're like £10. These colours don't look too different from each other. Must the camel are different. Yeah, but they don't look too different from each other. I haven't finished going through the colours. We also have cream. Okay. Red I thought would look really good if I went for a red lip as well. And pink. So how much are these each? £10 pounds each. I did just explain this. ASOS. Whereas Leanne's mum likes to say asshole. <laughs> Better. Quite a big head though, as I said before. I need okay, I need to put it on a mirror. In a mirror. Put it on in a mirror. 
Do you wear it like off to the side? I don't know. I've Does never this look cute? Do I look French? My little French. Should princess. I put makeup on? Oh well, bonjour, monsieur, blah blah. This is the pink. I like it. The fit feels good. It feels like it's very secure. I feel like this won't blow off because I have quite a large head. Uh, do they actually keep your head warm then? I mean, they don't really fit much of your head, do they? Yeah, I feel like this would keep your head warm. It's more of like a fashion accessory, isn't it? But I think it looks good. Let's give it like a little tour of my easily head. You make these. Go on then, make one then, Paul. We'll buy some fabric and just... It's just a circle of... We're a big cut out. Hmm. I really like the red one. I think red will look really good with a red lip. Like a black top, like a white top. What about your Burberry coat? Yeah, to be fair, these would all go with that. How does it look? I don't even know. So I kind of like curled it round and then that gave more of a shape to it and then it fits more on my head instead of it being like how it was, like that. It's hard to tell like when you're not wearing what you'd be wearing like a coat or something with it. You look cute if you had red lipstick as well. Hmm, I really like this one and now I know how to put it on my head. But uh, it looks better with this. Thanks Imagine now. if I turned up with 10 hats, she'd kill me. Yeah, but your hats wouldn't be £10, would they? Boys' hats are expensive. This is going to be sailor, put it on. I don't know if I like the piping, but I think... Why did they... did you... did, Where? did you know there was piping? Why would you order it with black piping and not just all white? I don't think I saw the piping, but I think when I put it on, I can hide this. ASOS, what have you done? This doesn't feel as tight. You definitely look like you in the Navy. <laughs> this one doesn't... As, I can't speak. This one doesn't feel as tight on my head. The hole but, is a lot bigger. I don't feel like it's the same style because we've got the trim on it. I don't think I like this one. How can you get that back in there? <laughs> I'm going to try the cheaper camel one. This one was £7.99 instead of £10. I love the colour. That's nice. Hmm. It's my favourite one so far. I love the colour of this one, I really like the fit of it and it doesn't feel too tight or too loose so I really like this one. I'm not so sure about the red one yet, I like the pink one and this one. I really like the red one. The others are more subtle, it's nicer. I prefer this colour, it's still nice but I prefer that, I prefer it lighter. Yeah, the colours are slightly different, I prefer the colour of the cheaper one so that's good. This is mustard. You don't think about getting a teal one. They didn't have any. I bought every colour that they had. Yeah, but it's very similar to that kind of feel of that one. Like if well, I they had, are quite if similar. I the, if I had the choice, I'd go for this one. This one was a bit nicer. Mm. Yeah, Grey's nice. Well, you've got a cracking figure. <laughs> um, <laughs> Thank you. Where'd that come from? I was just looking. Oh. What do we think of the grey? Yeah. I like the grey. Yeah, I like the grey. Last one is black. I think it needs like a top that isn't black. You look like an old school, like... Mine. Kind of, but also like a detective. Like, you're some sort of superhero detective girl. Why a superhero? Because I'm all in black. Yeah. Do you think choose a black one? Black's nice and easy, isn't it? I feel the berries suit me more. I tried getting onto the, the Baker Boy hats. They didn't work on my head, my head was too big. I don't know how they go on your head. <laughs> anyway, I just get the idea of the colour. <laughs> That's not how it sits, but... Um, yeah, but you don't need this many, do you? Yes, I do. What colour do you want to wear? This has got to be black, I'm not wearing any of those other colours. Okay. Or grey. Grey. Okay, I'm not wearing any I'm not doing that. <laughs> I want a grey. Because they did have pictures of men wearing them on ASOS. Yeah! You look like an artist. How you oh, doing? Bonjour, well. monsieur, do you know what I mean? I got you down here. I've got you down here. <laughs> I'm going to paint you something. Hello. Now you definitely look better. Thank you for your assistance. No problem. We are going to chill now. So we're going to say bye bye and we'll see you tomorrow. I know I've already said night, but I've just spent, wanted to show you the last hour replying to all my comments. Some of them I hadn't replied to for a week, but I'm still going. <laughs> They are now all up to date, so thank you very much to all those that have commented.